the skies are about to change forever. Meet the FAXX, America's next generation fighter jet, designed to replace the legendary F 22 Raptor and F 35 Lightning II. But here's the twist it's not the Air Force leading this revolution, it's the U.S. Navy. With global powers racing to create the first true sixth generation stealth fighter, the FAXX might just rewrite the rules of air combat. The question is, what makes this mysterious aircraft so different from anything we've seen before? The first glimpse of the FAXX came from a rough concept image released to the public, and it instantly sparked debate among aviation experts. Unlike traditional jets, this aircraft features a tailless blended wing body design, where the wings seamlessly merge with the fuselage. No vertical stabilizers, no obvious radar signature, just a smooth, predatory silhouette built for invisibility. Even the inlets are fully recessed, designed to eliminate radar resonance. Pair this with the most advanced radar absorbent composite materials available, and the FAXX promises to be far harder to detect than any fighter before it. To understand why the FAXX is such a leap forward, we need to look at the flaws of today's fifth-generation fighters. Vertical tail surfaces, even when angled in a V-shape like on the F-22 or F-35, still create radar reflections, making them visible to advanced detection system. Large jet inlets, essential for thrust, also generate resonances that low-frequency arrays can pick up, exposing stealth aircraft. Then comes the cost. Each F-35C sets the Navy back around $117.3 million, with a staggering $1.3 trillion life cycle cost. These fighters were revolutionary once, but now they're expensive, detectable, and increasingly outpaced by emerging threats. The FAXX is being designed to overcome every weakness of its predecessor by removing vertical tails, concealing its inlets, and adopting advanced composite materials, it eliminates the telltale signs that expose today's stealth jets. At the same time, it promises greater range, faster speeds, and improved affordability. For the Navy, this isn't just about a new aircraft. It's about redefining dominance in the skies for decades to come. While America pushes ahead with the FAXX, its rivals are not sitting still. China has spent years building an A2AD, Anti-Access Area Denial Shield, designed to keep U.S. aircraft carriers and fighters far from its shores. At the heart of this defense are powerful long-range missiles. The DF-21D, nicknamed the Carrier Killer, can hurl a 600-kilogram warhead over 2,100 kilometers. As if that weren't enough, Beijing followed it with the DF-26B a monster capable of delivering an 1,800-kilogram payload at ranges of up to 4,000 kilometers, far enough to threaten carriers before they can even launch planes. Then comes the DF-ZF hypersonic glide vehicle launched from the DF-17 missile. Traveling at speeds between Mach 5 and Mach 10, it can maneuver unpredictably, making interception nearly impossible. With these systems stationed across the South China Sea, East China Sea, and Taiwan Strait. China has turned key waterways into heavily defended zones. For the U.S. Navy, this means any fighter with limited range, like the F-35C, risks being neutralized before it even reaches the target. To stay relevant, the FAXX must not only outfly radar, but also outdistance hypersonic threats. The range issue is one of the biggest challenges for today's fighters. The F-35C has a flight range of about 1,200 nautical miles, but its combat radius is only half that, roughly 600 nautical miles. In a mission against China, this would place U.S. carriers dangerously close to enemy missile zones before the jets even launched. The FAXX must break this barrier. Analysts suggest it will need a combat range of at least 1,000 miles, and perhaps more, to strike from safe distance while keeping U.S. carriers out of reach of hypersonic weapons. Today's fifth-generation fighters rely on turbofan engines like the Pratt & Whitney F-135, 
which allow the F-35 to reach speeds of Mach 1.6 while carrying a full weapons load. Impressive for its time, but not enough for the challenges ahead. The FA-XX is expected to be powered by an adaptive cycle engine, ACE, a revolutionary design that can shift between turbofan and turbojet modes. This adaptability optimizes fuel efficiency during long-range cruising while unleashing raw power for supersonic flight. Early projections suggest sustained speeds above Mach 2 at altitudes near 65,000 feet, a dramatic leap forward in aerial performance. Stealth alone won't guarantee survival in tomorrow's battles. Modern Integrated Air Defense Systems IADS, now use advanced radars, some at very high frequency VHF, that can detect even stealth fighters like the F-22 or F-35. To counter this, the F-A-22 will require an advanced suite of electronic warfare and sensor system, passive infrared search and track. IRST arrays will scan for heat signatures without emitting signals, keeping the jet hidden. At the same time, the F-A-XX must be capable of jamming enemy radar and disrupting communication. Tying it all together, a powerful sensor fusion system will instantly combine this data into the pilot's interface, ensuring rapid, decisive action in contested skies. One of the most revolutionary aspects of the FAXX is its expected integration with Collaborative Combat Aircraft, CCA, more commonly known as the Loyal Wingman concept. In this vision, the FAXX won't fly alone. Instead, it will launch missions alongside up to four autonomous drones, each programmed for specialized roles. One might act as a decoy to draw enemy fire. Another could scout ahead to detect electronic threats, while a third monitors the rear for surprise attacks. Others could flank the FAXX, providing defensive cover or additional firepower. These drones will be guided by advanced artificial intelligence, capable of making independent decisions in real time. That means the pilot won't be forced to micromanage every move. Instead, after giving initial commands, the drones will carry out their tasks autonomously while still keeping the pilot in ultimate control. The result? A single fighter jet transforms into a miniature armada, combining manned precision with unmanned flexibility to overwhelm adversaries on every front. The Air Force's NGAD program was meant to lead sixth-generation air power, but it has stumbled with redesigns, shifting goals, and funding delays. Some contractors, like Northrop, have already stepped back, raising doubts about progress. In contrast, the Navy's F-A-22 is moving forward with clear goals and strong industry backing. Unlike NGAD's narrow focus on air superiority, FAXX promises multi-role dominance, blending stealth, strike power, electronic warfare, and drone integration, potentially putting the Navy ahead in the next era of air combat. The FAXX isn't just another fighter jet. It represents a shift in strategy and technology. With advanced stealth, AI-driven drone integration, and long-range strike capability, it could redefine modern warfare. More than hardware, it signals America's commitment to staying ahead in contested skies, ensuring air dominance against rising powers well into the 21st century. The FAXX could mark the beginning of a new era in aerial warfare, but will it truly secure America's dominance or trigger another global arms race? What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comments, hit like, and subscribe for more deep dives into cutting-edge military technology.